Scrub a dub dub, what's in the tub? What's going on, my subscribers? Ace here, here with some Pokemon Ultra Sun for you guys. And if you guys missed the last episode, you should definitely check it out because it was a fun one. We explored around a little bit on the Route 6. We met uh, a new character, well, not a new character, but we met an old fun character that we all love. And we have Jen out front because it is currently 4 11 p.m. for me. So if we train it up a bit and then we also level it up to 25 when it turns to 5 o'clock anywhere to 6 o'clock so most likely this will not be the episode that Rockruff evolved but we'll get it to the point so I'm thinking level 23 because I, I think I have two rare candies in my bag so we can kind of just like speed the system up there and uh, control when it's going to evolve so how many rare candies do we have we do have indeed have two so this is perfect so we can go down this route, and I think what we're actually going to do in this episode is not only explore this route, but we're also going to go down into town. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, no, we, we need to go that way. I was like, wait a second, that's a big open area. Ooh, hold on. Big open area? Oh, that's just like a back way. Feels. It all opens up into the same area, but we're going to be training up Rockruff at the same time today so it'll be a lot of Jenna out front today and I hope you guys don't mind too much but we need to get her up the levels and she's gonna get a little more levels than everyone else but you know that's fine at the same time because I'm very good at balancing my team it seems so far so I'm just gonna be having her out front and then once we get her into our new form we'll only we'll use her a little sparingly which will be fun but I, like, I, just, I just want the dust form Lycanroc, okay? Don't 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 blame me for that. Alright, we're level 20 already. See, we only need three more levels, and if we get it before then, then we'll just we'll just go on our merry way and Jenna won't have to be out front anymore. That's all good. It's all good. We can ro we can rotate the party after she reaches level 23. Because we do have two, so then at any point when the clock strikes the correct times, we shall be good to go. I'm really excited because I really like the look of the Alolan Lycanroc uh, dust form, and I'm like super excited and it's, it's making me not able to think properly, but, you know. <laughs> okay. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, so that, that route does not help me in any way, but it's all good in the hood. So we're just going to go down here into Hey Hey City, and hopefully we'll find some battles with trainers. You know what I mean? Oh, hello there, friend. So you sniffing around still? Bro. I swear I will actually slaughter your entire family if you don't get out of here. <sighs> okay, I guess we're not going down into the city because we're not allowed to. So I guess we're going up here towards the Battle Royale stuff. I guess. So howdy, friend. How's it? Going pretty good. How are you? The Battle Royale. It's... The imitation of Pokemon trainers have devised based on the battles that the four guardians of our islands like to take part in decide who's the strongest of them all. Ah. Ooh, item. I'm, I was going to talk to that guy, but then I saw this item. Ultra Ball? Nice. Or does this guy give me something like ten times better than an Ultra Ball? Alright, what's poppin', dude? The Pokemon that love to eat so-called garbage that human throw away really pr proves that the thing's value depend on where you stand, doesn't it? See, he gave us a life lesson that's ten times more valuable than... Oh, hi, Gladion. <laughs> Why do I do this? Every time something brings me down, I end up right back here again. Come on, Null. We'll beat everybody who stands before us. We're going to be strong enough to protect them this time. Aww. Gave us a life lesson, though. It's ten times more important than an Ultra Ball. Hello? I'm trying to talk to you. Hey! Oh, howdy, dude. Jam. Okay, well, look, at, look at this balloon right here. Like, that boy clearly standing next to it just so he can flex. He's like, yeah, that's me. I'm a badass. Yo, yo, look at her. Oh, biggest hand. I mean, it's like accurate, but damn those hands. <laughs> oh, wait, this is awkward. When you when you wearing the same thing. Yeah, he just pauses. He's like, yo, I'm out of here. I got to go change. <laughs> Feel like royalty when you manage to win a battle royale dome. Or feel like a true fan when you give Pokemon fan club a whirl. Alright, well let's pop in here and see what's popping. What's really good 
Oh. Dun, dun, dun. Glad you could make it. <laughs> Howdy, Kukui. I mean, masked guy. I am here today to spread the world. Yeah, about the Battle Royale. They call me the Mask Royale. Woo! Professor? The Mask Royale! I am here to teach you, oh yeah, about the battle formation passed down in Alola for generations. The the Pokemon Battle Royale. Woo! But Royale is... But Royale? What's the Battle Royale? You might ask. Four trainers! Four trainers, yeah. Each pick three Pokemon, yeah. And for one big battle, oh yeah. When one trainer's team cannot battle anymore, yeah, the pe the Pokemon Royale ends. Whichever trainer is taking out the most Pokemon, yeah, and has the most Pokemon left, will emerge the winner. Woo! All right, sounds good. First, give it a shot. Pick your Pokemon and let's do this. Dude, it's the Master Royale. I want a battle, I want a battle. You there, come join in on the fun. I'll mix in too, yeah? And we'll have a foursome. Woo! What? Gladion too? Discovery, new experiences, adventure, it's all yours if you want. It's time for a battle of Pokemon Royale. Ready? Fight! Hey, but I haven't chosen any Pokemon yet. I haven't chosen any mons yet. We're in the Battle Royale Dome, the arena for the Battles Royales. The dome is packed and filled with excitement. Hey, now here come the contenders. Ace in the green corner sends out Jenna. In the yellow corner, How sends out Dartrix. Oh, that's that's awkward. We both sent out a Rockruff. All right. And Gladion sent out Type Null! Alright, so how clearly has the advantage here? <gasps> He's super effective against two types. That's kind of cheating. Alrighty then. Uh. Oh god, it's lagging really bad. I'm gonna go for the Fire Fang on the Dartrix. I am not trying to get obliterated. Oh god, I'm not even healed! This is some bullshit. If I lose this, this does not count. Oh, and he's burned! Bless. Pursuit. You cook! I see how it is. Can I use potions in this? You piece of shit! Fuck. Fuck. I'm about to get bopped. That's fucking rude. I'm so mad. Wakukui, you dirty bitch! I'm mad! That's actually rude! I'm so mad! Hello, it didn't even let me choose Pokemon! Bro. I'm so mad. No, I don't care! Oh, I hope you bring that fire that you will burn up my trial. Okay, I, I, I was so mad. That's some bullshit! The name's Kukui. It, okay, it definitely said choose three Pokemon. I only had one. It was not healed up. Two. And they triple teamed me. Kukui protected. So he's like, nah, fuck you. I'm not getting hit by none of this. So you take additional damage because I didn't get hit by it. Additionally, Type No pursued me and I got leafaged. And then Kukui targeted me down for the kill. What a dick! I would have killed Dartrix and I would have won. Or tied at least. <sighs> Actually no, Kukui still would have won. But that's some bullshit! <laughs> the name's Kaiwi, the fire captain. You get, you know, like, you know how the game's just like, come on Ace, like, get over it. It's, it's, it's just a battle royale. No! It's a... Okay. <laughs> you can get to the Well of Volcano Park from uh, Route 7. It, I'll be waiting at the peak. If you plan to see your island challenge through to the end, climb to the top when you're the strongest team. Okay. So, Ace How, how are your trials going? I hope you and your Pokemon are working hard and having a blast. Woo! But, Mr. Master Royale, how do you even know what we're doing trials right now? 
Oh yeah, I get it because of our amulets, huh? Well, I'll ha I'm having a blast. But why are you here? Why did you even want to do a battle royale? You're still trying to get stronger or something? Oh, <laughs> you just want to make some friends. <laughs> Damn, he just roasted Gladion. Damn, Gladion's like, fuck you, I'm out. I'm not here to play. I'm here because you can't protect anything when you're weak. Wow, you're just a rain of sunshine, eh? I think you'd have a lot more fun if you'd let yourself have a good time with everybody else. You can do a lot more together, too. Well, I don't know what his deal is, but I I thought the battle was just plain fun. That's why I keep doing battle royales, and my Pokemon seem to like them, too. Okay, can, can I get out of here? Oh, thank God. Whew. Oh, wait, I didn't talk to the people inside. Feels. Alright. Wait, is Jenna, like, is Jenna fainted? Oh, no, they healed her up. Bless! So was it worth it in the end? No. I got cheated, man. That's, that's some bullshit. If Pokemon have taken damage from someone else's attack, try and deal a finishing blow. I got BS'd, man. Getting targeted by all the trainers is proof that you're the strongest. So, but even so, you can't win in a battle royale if all you do is protect yourself all the time. I guess it's true. Ah! A sticker! I knew there was a good reason to come back here. Alrighty then. Hello, miss. I'll tell you something Professor Cuckoo taught me. Moves that can attack all other Pokemon on the field, like Razor Leaf and Air Cutter, actually have their power cut in Battle Royales. That's true. So it divides the power between each opponent, but depending on how many opponents it is, de depends on the power. So when Cuckoo protected, it actually increased the power of Leafage between the two of us because it wasn't spread between three. So the, the power, like the power of Leafage, wasn't divided by three; it was divided by two. If that makes sense, but yeah. Do you think pro wrestlers change costumes so much uh, so they can sell new merch? That's probably, yeah, probably. The Battle Royale format is fun because you don't know who your allies are. Granny, please, you gotta buy me a Master Royale mask. Oh? Hi, have you participated in Battle Royale? Have you battled the, uh, of course. Well, awesome! The Master Royale is so cool, right? I want a mask. I wish I could find it somewhere. Alright, noted. If I find a mask. Oh! Another sticker. That was a sneaky one. It's kind of like off to the edge. What does this up here? Will you win or will you be done in? Welcome to the thrilling Battle Royale Dome. Okay, so I can't go through that area. Feels. But that was a little bit of a sneaky one. Okay, just making sure there's no little stickers over here. Okay. There's a kid who's been winning tons of Battle Royale matches lately. I think his name was Gladion. Would you look at that, Rockruff? I think I can still put out a bit more effort. Aw, oh, feels. Well, it's going to evolve soon, so eh. <laughs> Can't just call Jenna, like, lackluster. Beat your ass. All right. Okay, um, hello there, friend. When you get your hands on a fishing rod for the first time, you just can't wait to go to the shore and search for Pokemon, can you? Hmm. Okay, the Malasada shop. Captain Mallow is an amazing cook, too, especially that Mala special. It's a tasty explosion in my mouth. Alright, I don't particularly want any Malasadas or anything, but I'll talk to everybody in here. Oh, hello, Pugumuku. We're members of the Malasada fan club, self-appointed Malasada promoters. I'm Mala. This is by Puku Muku, Puku Kuku. Puku. We're working hard day and night to promote how delicious Malasadas are. Let's start, Puku Muku. Puku. Okay. I. Okay. I. I. Okay. 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 I'm I'm am just gonna I'm just gonna keep pressing A. I don't know what I got myself into, and I'm just gonna keep moving on. I appreciate their support, but they're a bit distracting. Well, focus, focus. Let's get back to selling all the sauce. Yeah, I'm I'm just gonna I'm just gonna keep moving. We have moving milk. We can make mythical. Please give us... 
Okay, sure, have a moo milk. Just leave me alone. Moo milk, moo milk. Okay, alright. Bro. 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 Here you go, big mouth of soda. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> Please let me leave. I just want to leave. Uh, oh, come on, bro. Bro, get out of here. Leave me be. Can I go? Okay, I'm out of here. Thank God. See my pseudo wudo? It's got a laxator, so it likes sal uh, sour mouth sauce. Ah, hello there. Sour mouth sauce and dry mouth sauce. I think they. Okay. You sleeping? Cool. The black belt there. His focus is amazing. It's like he's tuned out the entire world. I mean, he's sleeping, bro. <laughs> okay. Hopefully I never have to see the Malasada lady again. What is this? Well, this looks like fun. Oh, it's a Pokemon fan club. Hello there, friends. Greetings. Okay. What do you have to say? Welcome to the Pokemon Boom Club. This is where Pokemon... Okay. Got it. Howdy, me off, friend. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh... I was just saying. Are you taking photos of your picket uh, Okay. Alright, so I'll be a true fan when I get more affection towards my Pokemon. Hey, do you know about the Everstone? I do. That's right. What if I say I don't? Okay, so like I can't I can't choose my thing about it. Alright. So if I choose some different, uh, if I do some more, like, friendly stuff, then my Pokemon will be more friendly towards me. Fair enough. And then he'll recognize me as a true thing and probably give me something. Aha! I see a sticker on that. Very nice. Did I talked to you before? Oh, yes, I did. Okay. Cool. Okay, I think that's everything. Wait. Pink Nectar. Cool. Pokemon fan club. Uh, okay. Got it. Ooh, another pink nectar. Gimme. Howdy, little man. How are you doing? Are you a person of courage? I think so. Is that right? That's nice for you. People, perhaps a courageous person like you would be listen to my worries and be able to help me. Do you have a free minute? Yes, I do. It's taking all the courage I have not to make myself talk to you like this, I'm afraid. This is how easily my courage is all used up. Just striking up a simple conversation is really pathetic, I know. So please, please, could you tell me a story of courage that will inspire me to feel a bit braver? And so you told the boy about taking part in the Battle Royale. Wow, that's amazing! You actually took part in a Battle Royale? Even just having a battle against one other person takes plenty of courage. But going up against three trainers at once, you can do that? You know, hearing about that gave me courage. I'd say about 20% courage now. If you don't mind, please come tell me more courage to use when you can. Aw, sure, bro. Aw, what a nice little kid. <laughs> okay, so I guess we're forced to go up the other way. Uh, I guess we can go to the mart as well. I like, but I, I like my, the focus I wanted to do was to train, but. That happens. Well, a trainer, are you gonna go to the, do the battle royale? Uh, uh, I already did actually. Uh, you gotta. You got to drive safe and watch out for Pokemon that might leap out at you. That's fair enough. Howdy, Mr. Hypno. Oh, it's an actual Hypno. Interesting. Alright. I just felt like there might be stuff on these trucks. Okay. Who parks like this? You can see the QR code for any Pokemon you've caught in the Pokedex, did you know? I did not actually know that. Alright. I feel like there'd be a sticker over here somewhere. Aha! I knew it! Got 25 now. Bless. Ah! An item. HP up. Very nice. Okay. Getting used to these placements of certain items in particular. Okay, we can go back to the shop. I kind of just want to go train a little bit. Okay, up we go. We're going up the route. We'll, we'll go into the, the shop a little bit after we train just a bit. Hello, I see that Magmar just like walking out. Bro, that was cool. You're missing out if you don't ever, if you don't ever see Captain Kaiwi's dancing. Now go up to the volcano. 
How about no? There's an odd little rocker here, and I wonder why. Aha! There's a sticker there. Alright, cool. Got it! Alright, so we're gonna train right here and catch Pokemon at the same time. Just to get uh, Jin up to level uh, 23. So that next episode, because I think by the end of this episode and start of the next episode, it'll be right around 5 o'clock, and we can do our due diligence. So let me just hit this thing up with a tackle, because if I hit it with a rock throw, then it's going to get obliterated. And then we can catch this Pokemon as well. Because catching Pokemon has EXP as well, as perfect. Alright. Let's go for the Y into a Pokeball. Use! Also, really excited to catch two Pokemon. There we go. Nice. Nice and callous Pokemon. Nice and a fleshling. I'm about it, bro. Alright, hit up the care. Dene. Registered. Okay. Next. Um, for some reason, I just kind of want to call you Flick. I don't have any particular reason why. It just kind of sounds like a name that seems fitting to you. Send a box. All right. Oh, <laughs> silly Jenna. Just <laughs> I was like, wait a second. Why do I have a dog here with fluff all over it? All right. There you are. Perfect. Okie doke. Alright, so level 23 is what we're looking for. Okay, so let's train here a little bit. We might go up the, the mountain a little bit. I just want to see what Pokemon we can get here. Ooh, a Salendit. Hopefully it's female. It is male. Okay. Well, we need to sell end it anyway, so that's fine. Uh, let's just go for a rock throw, because why not? It's level 18, which is kind of high level. Perfect. Sweet scent. I know that getting a female one of these is, like, almost next to impossible, but... It's kind of cool at the same right. Ember, okay. Just don't burn me and we're golden. Don't call for help. Don't do it. Don't do it. What? Feels bad, man. Alright, well. Guess just tackle the one that we already were battling. Get him out of here. Dragon Rage? Oh, sh shiz. That's a powerful ass move to have this early in the game. Hello? That's super rude. What the? Alright, well, luckily I have a Pokemon that can kind of be ready for that, but. Jesus, okay. Just Dragon Rage and random ass. Okay. Just revive Jenna back up because I don't want Jenna not to get EXP from this. The entire point of coming up here was to get it. So, let's see here. Fight! Um, let's just go for the chip away. Speed set. Okay, so he, he doesn't want to miss his move on me again. Got it. Chip away. Hoo! Oh god, that just obliterated your life. I am sorry, friend. You did not deserve that. Okay. Well, I simply be silent, dude. Okay. Much likes might be too strong. Okay, Jenna's out front. That's perfect. That's what we need. All right, let's go into our bag here and pop these potions that we have stacked up. I think they're around here somewhere. Oh, are they done at the bottom? There they are. Use this item. That'll do. Okay, so let's explore a little bit while we're, while we're going about our ways. Oh, an item. Dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. Ooh, a Magby. 
I do need a Magby as well. I'm just trying a Pokeball. My gut says throw a Pokeball, but I know the Magby has a really high catch rate, so it might be a little tough. Yeah. Worth a try. Ember, Pokey Doke. Just don't burn me or golden. Less, okay. Uh, let's go for the bite here. Oh, he has slam body. Fire spin, that's fine. Because this great ball is going to catch you. Don't call for help, bro. Don't call for help. Don't do it. Thank God. Okay. <laughs> no one come. Nobody likes the butthead. Alright, here we go. Great ball go! Cause like I said, Magby has a very difficult catch rate. Like I said, it's gonna be a tough one. Smoke screen, this is fine. And the fire spin is tacking on. Ooh, that's a lot of damage actually. I don't particularly like that. How about you just stay in this Pokeball and be a little good, butthead. Oh! Frick! Fire spin, okay. Ooh, this is a little tough. That's gonna do a good amount of damage. Jesus, the fire spin damage racks up. Don't call for help! Stop it! Stop it right now! Frick. Another Magby. Alright, hold on. I can't swap because of fire spin, so we're going to super potion up. Get some healing going. Okay. I get bur you, you can't be freaking serious. And my accuracy is double lowered. That's fantastic. And fire spins going. Alright, so if any time there was to use the full restore, it is now. I swear to god if he burns me. Smoke screen, that's fine. Fire spin is freed! Okay. Um, so what do I go into here? I think actually I think I just rock throw and I hit this mag B, hopefully. There we go. Thank god. Good. <laughs> Smacked him with a rock to the head. Okay. So my accuracy is lowered. This is not amazing, but you know, at the same time it's okay. I'm gonna throw a great ball at you and just see what happens. You know what? Just see what happens. Oh! 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 It actually was close. This one seems a little more lenient. Don't burn me. Okay, thank god. Okay, uh, let's throw a rock at him. See what happens. Okay, fan attack. Holy crap, that did a, a good chunk. God dang. Come on, bro. Uh, this stupid Magby! Because now I have to heal. This is some bull. I'm not happy about this at all. Alright, give me that healing. Stupid Magbys, bro. I'm just trying to catch you. Stop calling for help. I can't hit anything if you keep smoke screening me, you cuck. Alright, this one's gonna hit for sure. God dang it! Stop it! Right now. Alright, hold on. We got this, we got this, we got this. This rock throw right here. Focus. Put your spectacles on. Yeah, there we go! Oh! I did so much! I thought I was gonna kill it. I was actually gonna be a little upset. That's actually perfect. Like, it's like 1 HP. Don't call for help. Okay. Bless. Throw the great ball! That's like the, the most glorious. You're you actually kidding me? You gotta be kidding! All right, let's go. One last great ball to save them all. Actually, we have many more great balls, but come on, come on! Yes, let's go. Easy boys. Nice. Hit the care up. Alright. Hey, little Magby friend.
Uh, sure. I will name you Donna. Okay. Onward we go. Dun, 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 dun. You can prescribe that to any one of the, like, four Donnas in TV shows or movies that are redheads as well. So, yee. And if your name is Donna and you're a redhead, then, yeah, it can be you too. <laughs> oh, you got all muddy, bro. I understand. He got the smoke screen everywhere. It's okay, Jenna. Don't worry. We'll clean you up. Okay. Out we go. So what level are you now? I think still 20? 20, 21? 21? Something like that? Okay, hold on. Let's see here. 20? Okay. I think you're like right at the the cusp. Give me this item. Hyper Potion. Fantastic. Okay. And let's go to our bag real quick and pop a potion or two. Nice and nice. Okay. And there's a trainer right here, which is actually perfect. Because trainer battles give you significantly more uh significantly more EXP. So this is fine. Dun, 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 hey, it's a meowth. I mean yeah, that's right. Hey, alright. Uh, and let's just go for the bite. Why not? Oh, I'm trading bites. Don't flinch me. I don't know why I asked for anything anymore. Like, oh god. Or, cool. Alright, I gotta heal. God dang. Like, this is against a normal type and still getting smacked around. All right, hold on. Let me see here. Uh, where are my super potions at? There we go. I mean, this thing's actually about to give me the malignant. Day. Like the level gaps are not as far as I'd hoped. All right, fury swipes. Chill, chill, chill. Bro, we got all five. It's crazy. All right, let's go for the rock throw. Screech. Oh god, that's not good. That's really not good. Please kill. Yes. Get out of here. Alright. Okay. Well, that was an experience, but we did get another level. So we only need two more. And we should be good to go. I might train up off screen. But we can explore this route a little bit more. And this is the way up to his challenge anyway, so that's fine. But yeah, you know, it's all good. Dun, dun, dun. Okay, so let's head up this way. Howdy there. I'm the cutest of the Seismic Sisters, a trio of siblings who love, love, love volcanoes. The cave here leads to the top of the volcano, just so you know. Okay. Howdy, friends. Good job making this high. I don't know if we hit your Pokemon for you. Yes. Okay, found an antidote. Alright. Here we go. Ooh, another. Ooh, a float stone. Howdy, miss. I'm the prettiest of the Seismic Sisters. Okay. Same thing. To the other side of the volcano? Okay. What's on the other side? Hello there. I'm the most charming of the Seismic Sisters. A tree. Okay, so. Path leads to the left side of the volcano, just so you know. Got it. Oh, howdy, Ace Trainer guy. Perfect. I needed somebody to battle you anyway. And I'm glad that they healed me up. Dun dun dun. Dun, dun, dun. Ace Trainer Jim. Howdy, Jimbo. How you doing? I like that. Perfect. You can catch a rock throw. Now, closer we on levels. 21, 21. Alright. Let's go for a rock throw here. Pop him up. Goodbye, my friend. 
224, that's not nearly enough experience. Alright, keep battling. Alright, fights. We need the bite. Ooh, side beam. That's a little scary. Oh my god! That did so much damage. Holy crap. Alright. Super potion it is. Side beam? Okay. Please don't do that much again. God dang. Okay. Alright. We gotta swap. Into VJ we go! Which walls every single way that you can hit me. That's right, punk. What do you know about dark types? It's a bite. Disable. Aha! You fool! Alright, I'll split the I'll split the EXP. Holy crap, Psybeam did so much damage. It's not okay. I thought that that freaking thing might help, but... Okay. Bro, that was intense. Need to chill. How do I get to that thing there? Ah. I gotta get off the Tauros for that. Alright, feels bad, man, but it's okay. Ooh, a Cubone. Howdy, little friend. How are you? Alright, let's go for a just regular Pokeball. I feel like we can catch a Cubone. Come on, friend. I know you want to be a part of the the box familia. Alright. Not quite ready for it. Headbutt. I'm not quite doing that much, but you know, it's all good. Uh let's go for let's go for a bite. Let's see how much it does. Obviously the level gap, but it's chunky. Alright. Let's see if that that we can jump a little bit. Slant you our way. Uno. Dos. Tres. Yeah. Let's go, Q Bone. Q Bone, Bone, Bone. <laughs> Let's go. Alrighty then. Ooh, we're so close to a next level. Okay. Q Bone. Yo, look at him. He's like, Hata. Look at the stylus. Hey, <laughs> yeah. Hmm. Uh, sure, you can get a nickname. Hmm. I'm gonna name you Dan. Because I had a wrestling buddy who was like one of my mentors when I was younger, and we just knew him as Dan the Man. And you just, you just remind me of him, okay? Oh, goodness, there's a guy right there. Okay. Uh, let's get off the turtles real quick. Let's run over, get this TM real quick. Maybe it's something good that we might need. Ooh, there's an R slice. Oh, Rock Doom! Let's go! That's a move that we can use. Alright, bag. Uh. It's perfect, actually. Uh, not charge beam. We need Rock Tomb. There we go. 60 power, 95% accuracy. Better than Rock Throw. Better than Tackle as well. Tackle's like a nice overall coverage move. Nah, I'm just I'm never I like I hardly use tackle anyway. Like in 90% of situations I use rock throw anyway. There's also a a nice little uh, picture slot here. The firing of the Pokey Finder. What am I looking at here? Ooh. Okay. Nice. Okay. And who can I like go go this way? There we go. Got him. Bruh. Okay. What drone are we showing off? Uh. That one. That one's the golden one. Alright. New high score! 
Uh, okay. Get out of here. Close the Pokefinder. Alright, so let's battle this guy. We should get another level. And then we can end the episode off and be successful! Because then we'll get to level 22, which getting another level in the next episode shouldn't be too hard, to be honest. Should be pretty easy. Alright, Rug and Roller. That's gonna be a little more difficult to get through, but you know, it's all good. In the hood. Well, look at that, we're so close to 22. Alright, Rock to him. Obviously, it won't be that effective against you, but it's decent. Mud Slap, okay. How much is that doing to me? No damage. It's super effective, but it's doing no damage. My accuracy fell, no! Okay, Rock to him again. Yes! Our accuracy hasn't fallen enough that we can't hit anything! Sanit oh no, he's lowering the accuracy! No, 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 we can do this, we can do this, we can do this! Hit this Rock to him, hit this Rock to him, hit this Rock to him! Yeah! We keen eye, bitch! Not really, we're own tempo, but you know, it's all good! Let's go! Ah, level 22. Easy, boys, easy! There are some mountains I can't climb. I'm talking about you and your Pokemon. Well, thank you, bro. I appreciate the compliment. Okay. So let us dust off real quick. Okay, and then in the next episode, we'll get up to level 23, so it shouldn't be too hard. It's like a battle or two. And then we will roll out, and we will evolve something into something new that hasn't been seen before on my channel, and I'm excited. Oh, I'm so excited for the new like and rock form. Oh, I'm hyped. Okay, but either way, if you guys did enjoy the episode, make sure to drop a like on that like button down below. So we need, what, one more battle? Or one more level, and then we have the two things. So how much EXP do we need? 1,350. Okay, that's doable. All right, but either way, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to that like button down below if you did enjoy, and I'll see you guys in the next episode for the exciting conclusion of this I don't know, this adventure that we're going on. Well, the adventure of evolving like rock, okay? Either way, see you guys in the next one. Bye bye